Now, animals could be pretty stupid at times, like us humans, not gonna lie. They poke their noses into other animals' businesses, and sometimes they learn things the hard way. Today, I bring you examples of these sorts of encounters that show us how animals regret making their decisions. Sit back, relax, and prepare to see these dumb animals being taught a lesson for their antics. Stick around to the end of the video for our final clip. I promise you, you won't regret it. Welcome to Animals Wow TV. Let's get started. If I were the owner, I would have done something about it instantly because we all know how dangerous horses can be, am I right? Especially with a dog that small. Anywho, the little ragamuffin keeps going at his antics. The horse gives off a few warning shots. When the horse sees that this guy isn't giving up that easy, he makes sure that this was the last day the dog made it feel annoyed. A straight headshot to the cranium. Look at him running away now. Oh, you're gonna do it, you're gonna go! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, oh my! These gangster cats from the alley are about to meet their maker. And their maker is someone pretty ironic. What seems to me is that this rat is going to take some personal grudges out on these cats that have probably caused it some sort of pain in the past. Look at our little rat friend go. He sure isn't holding back any longer. I hope he isn't on any sort of suicide mission because he's going all in. He's going to make sure those cats regret crossing paths with him ever again. <laughs> Oh my lord, that poor little cow. That snake sure thought that the calf would make an easy snack. But buddy, I do not think you yourself are that big. The snake looks exhausted as it's no longer trying to wrap itself around the cow. The cow, on the other hand, is taking the anaconda for the ride of its life by dragging its almost lifeless body around the whole farm. I'm pretty sure that snake won't be coming back for seconds after this encounter. This giraffe is minding its own business, but that mother Gemsbach and her kid are trying their best to get on its nerves, aren't they? Kinda reminds me about that one mother and child pair over in the grocery store that always annoys every other shopper around them. The giraffe has had enough and softly kicks the baby Gemsbach and knocks it to the ground. That giraffe's actually tough. Well, baby rule. So, what happened was that this cat was just walking down this street when suddenly this dog began barking at it just because it felt like it. So the cat decided, why not show the dog who actually runs these streets? The bold cat runs right inside the cage and straight up attacks the dog. The poor dog, scared for its life, runs everywhere to escape the wrath of this kitty cat. And this is also kind of the reason why I love cats. They just don't care who they're up against. Real cojones. One of the two heavyweight champions of the land animals. These hippos and rhinos really are a sight to behold. Seeing them fight one another is truly something else. The picky rhino seems to be swallowing more than he can chew. The hippo later shows it who's boss and nudges him away from the water hole. Here we have another rhino that's being annoyed by yet another animal for no reason at all. I think the species in general has some sort of mental issue. Come on, man. Realize from the warning shots that the giraffe is giving you, he is not playing. Oh, damn, that has got to hurt. That was so loud, and I bet the rhino is seeing nothing but stars right now. Oh. <laughs> Man, I'm telling you, these rhinos seriously need to chill. First the hippos, then the giraffe, and now a full-grown elephant? Talk about digging your own grave, man. This bull elephant will take no prisoners and look at it go full out on this idiot rhino. He is just tossing the rhino and its baby around like they're nothing but ragdolls. That is a lot of power. Looks like he sure taught that rhino how to stay humble. Cause look at those guys run. 
This is National Geographic. Oh my God, baby. <laughs> A raccoon seems to have been caught in a very tight situation over here. Surrounded by chimps, I can only imagine the horror that little fella is going through. These chimps can be very dangerous, even when they're actually being playful. Run, little guy, run. I wasn't expecting that. Holy hell. That chimp sent it flying from the tail and ouch, that was a hard landing. This little guy is making a break for it now, and it's caught between the pipes. Not a good day for Rocket. <laughs> this crocodile is in for a world of hurt. How do I know? That's because that right there, my friend, is an electric eel. And boy, do those things hurt. Some of these eels can prove very fatal for some animals. And on that list, this crocodile can easily find its name. As soon as the crocodile bites into this eel, it sets off its electricity generator and that is it for the croc. Sadly though, our friend Croc died after enduring such a long and powerful electric shock. Hopefully not in vain, and the rest of his friends remember not to ever mess with an electric eel again. This goat right here escaped from its pen and decided to wreak havoc upon this herd of horses. Annoyed by the goat, they clearly show agitation towards it by shoving it a little bit. That is one adamant goat if I have ever seen one, and it would be no surprise to me if it got kicked by one of these horses. The heat is rising, and the horses are getting spooked even more. Ah, yeah, there it is, the kick I was hoping for. I would say that it was rightfully placed because that goat was just not giving up on trying to pick a fight with a 1200 pound opponent. This cowardly hyena is running because it killed an innocent lion cub in cold blood. The cub's father delivers its due justice and makes quick work of the hyena. As the saying goes, an eye for an eye, a leg for a leg, and uh, whatever you can think of. I guess you get my point. Guess who had the last laugh now, Ed? Look at Shenzi, Banzai, and the rest of them run away, not wanting to be the next hyena on the hit list. An alligator made its way very far from its pond and right into the grazing grounds of these horses. The male horse, confused yet brave, decided to guide our lost alligator back to its pond. In doing so, my little horse friend stomped the living poop out of this poor gator and made sure to embed in its mind never to come back here again. Here is a post-war scene of a leopard that thought it was a good idea to pick a fight with a porcupine. My poor guy is picking out the quills one by one and softly licking his wounds. That is one animal he is not going to try and eat next time. Trust me, those quills are actually really sharp. One of them actually managed to puncture my car's tire too. Now, the clip you've been waiting for. Camels are seen to be as tamed and timid animals, aren't they? But once you piss them off and get on their nerves, they become completely different animals. This donkey learned it the hard way as he was trying to do something way out of line to the camel. <coughs> the camel, of course, infuriated, picked it up with its bare mouth. If you think that was it, get a load of this. The camel managed to break the donkey's spine and that poor creature completely forgot how to walk. I hope he got better later on, but man, play stupid games and win stupid prizes. Alright, that's it for today guys. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. Do smash that like button if this video was to your liking. Comment down below which matchup you thought was the best. Subscribe to our channel if this is the sort of video that you like to watch and I hope to see you in the next one. See you soon in the next video.